Hi there, this is Miss Nelson here again, and today we are doing lesson 3.4 in our 4th grade Florida Go Math book. Lesson 3.4 is multiplying using partial products. Um, we basically did this in lesson 3.3. It's pretty much the same as lesson 3.3, just this time we're adding in the step of estimating the problem first. So they're giving us the problem of 34 times 57. And first, we want to find an estimate. So we round 34 to 30 and 57 to 60. That estimate, we can do our basic fact of 3 times 6, which is 18. And then add our two zeros for 1,800. That's how to find the estimate. And then using partial products is down here in steps one through four. So basically, they're having you first multiply the tens by the tens. So if we wrote this out in a model, it would be the 30 times the 50, which is 1,500, because our basic fact of three times five and add two zeros. And then after that, they want you to multiply the ones by the tens. So 30 times 7. 30 times 7 is 210. Then they want you to multiply the tens by the ones. So 4 times 50, which is 200. And then finally, this last little box over here, which is the ones by the ones. So 4 times 7, which is 28. So all these different answers, products that we got, those are called the partial products. When you add all those together, that should give you your complete total answer. So see here, they have 1,500 plus 210 plus 200 plus our last one, which would be 28. And then when we add all that together, we get 1,938. So we can tell that's a reasonable answer because it's close to our estimate of 1,800. So basically, you already know how to do this if you're in my class. It's basically the same way as making the model with the distributive property and then adding all the partial products up to get your final answer and making sure that it's reasonable by having your estimate there. Um, if you're in my class, what I want you to do is write down this code word, which is applesauce, and I want you to show it to me tomorrow. That shows me that you have listened to this video. If anybody has any questions, just feel free to leave me a message. Thanks.